want our students to be musical, to be happy, to be smart, to be successful, to be natural. So today I'm delighted to announce that the college has decided to eliminate the B flat from the musical scale. Well, science has shown that the brain can only handle seven independent stimuli at one time, so therefore something's got to go. I mean, I'm a guitarist, so I don't particularly need that note. My parents thought this, this idea was pretty crazy. Because... You know what? Here's my view. Parents have always been wrong, right? Oh. My parents hated the Beatles. They hated rock and roll. Turned out to be a really important musical trend. With all B-flat, there's be less tension, happy vibes. What are we going to do with transposing instruments, like the tenor or the clarinet? We have to ask ourselves, do we really need these instruments? So maybe the B-flat instruments just go the way of the harpsichord. Hey! Who played the B-flat? I know I heard it. No, it was more than that. I'm so disgusted. You too, Vlad? You too? We never use it, we never listen to it. If a song's in B-flat, throw it out. I originally came here to study the clarinet. That actually freed me up to explore another passion of mine, which was tap dancing. Oh, my students are gonna love it because you know what? They all like playing just in C major. When you think of the evolution of human beings, I mean, we learn to make music with just one note. Think of ohm. Oh. As a vocal principal, to be asked to be flat. But as Zoe, a I totally, I'm getting goosebumps just I'm... listening to you. This note has damaged people. Hi, I'm Christopher Guest. Uh, I debated whether or not I should wear this shirt. No, as Christopher explains, the, the B-flat clarinet not only damaged him, I'm sure it damaged his parents listening to him learn it. Brutal. To be saddled with a B-flat clarinet was it's insulting, and uh, I moved on. Change is hard, um, and I, I get that. People still want B flat. I think you're investing in the past. You know what Stravinsky said, the more I restrict myself, the freer I am. People ask me, won't there be resistance to the elimination of the B flat? And I say, of course there will be. When Rite of Spring was first performed, there were riots. We expect resistance. There are always people who prefer buggy whips and flip phones to the future. Have you seen this yet? There's no B-flat. There's no B-flat. I like that. I never liked B-flat. I'm learning Tchaikovsky's piano concerto in B-flat, so I don't really know what do I do. There's a concept called transposition, where you just take it and move it into a better key. The whole thing. Just... Yeah. There okay. you go. How would it change your playing? Um. <laughs> Piano students are going to find it very difficult to leave out the B flat. Uh, it's a question of muscle memory. So I was wondering what's going to happen with A sharp. I know what you're trying to do. A sharp won't fly. A sharp is just like the B flat, 466 cycles a second. Instead of get your kicks on Route 66, no more licks in 466. I'm excited. I think we've made the world a better place. I think fewer notes will make better music. So don't despair. You got 11 tones left, go after it. <laughs>